as you already know about OpenSense now. To get started, you need to download OpenSense Next Generation Firewall. So in this video, I'll show you how we can download and then how to make it ready for the installation. So we'll be downloading the OpenSense and we'll be preparing the installation media and then we will continue for the installation in next video. So let me show you. We will simply go to opensense.org, which is a true open source security platform. It's opensense.org. So you will be going to the website and then click on download. And the moment you download, you will see here, these are the options available. Of course, on home page also, you will see OpenSense 25.1. So download OpenSense, you will see this page here. So you can see here architecture, it's AMD 64-bit system architecture. Here you can see it tells you that if you want to download the ISO installer image, live system capabilities in the VGA mod on AMD, UEFI boots is supported as well. So I will be going with the DVD installer here because I want to directly get the ISO image that I can use for hardware by burning this ISO image into DVD. Second option is of course you can uh, upload it into your virtual appliance or virtual machine or virtual environment and from there you can start installing it in the virtual environment. And third option is of course you can uh, download it as a VGA uh, USB image format and then you can write it to the USB flash disk and make it a bootable USB and start installing it. First of all download the DVD and here is the uh, mirror location whatever location is near to you you can choose that location and click on download. So it will start downloading here. So here the download is completed now. I'll go back here. You can see here this is the file which is OpenSense 25.1 DVD AMD dot ISO dot BZ2. Now this is the BZ2 which is a zip format actually. Uh, the file size is 509 MB. Uh, once we extract this, this will be more. So what we are going to do, we will extract this using WinRAR. With some extraction software I have seen, it's not working, but with me, it worked here. So I'll be extracting it. Let us wait for this to complete and I'll come back to you. All right, so here, this is the ISO image. I can simply change its name, for example, OpenSense uh, 25.1. Uh, this is the ISO image. You can write it to the DVD. Of course, if you want to install it on the bare metal server, as I have mentioned, either you, you can use Protectly or you can use uh, any other hardware. Of course, the installation process will be same for any kind of hardware or virtual machine. Whether it is hardware, whether it is virtual appliance, process is same in both cases. So prepare your installation media, whether you want to install it on the virtual machine, whether you want to install it on the bare metal server or bare metal system. Protectly is something that I recommend and I have also mentioned its details. You can go for it if you really want to have a dedicated hardware for your firewall. So let us continue to the next video where we will start installing OpenSense.